What's up, guys? It's your boys, the Wokey, back out with another scary, crazy, creepy, all around crazy paranormal act activity kind of video. And we're going to be taking a look at King Frostmare, which is up to bat for the newest, scariest video for us to watch and enjoy and get scared and hopefully not lose our pants or not lose our pants, but wet our pants, and take a look at the scariest videos you cannot switch off. So with that being said, challenge is accepted for you and I on Scary Wizard Wokey to watch King Frostmare's newest video and hopefully not turn it off. Let's take a look. If you guys are new to my channel, if you guys are returning and have not subscribed yet, make sure you guys subscribe down below by hitting that red bar icon down at the bottom right. Turn on notifications by hitting the bell icon next to it so I do post videos like this one. You're going to get that ring notification as Wokey myself has posted that video. And then you guys can watch, comment, like, and share. And again, I say this on every video, but thank you guys so much for the support. We're growing by the numbers. Subscribers, comments, likes, and shares. Keep doing what you guys are doing, and I surely appreciate it. And tell your friends and your family. But without further ado, we're going to get to King Frostmere's newest video. Also, go over to his channel, do the thing, subscribe, comment, like, and share. Give him the love that he deserves for putting this together for us and enjoying and getting scared and hopefully having some nightmares. But again, let's get in the video and see what he has for us tonight. Let's take a look. Record it. Let's take a look. It's an SD quality, though. What are we watching? Whoa! Okay, the only thing that I have a question about is why is when they push play, that bottom recorder where it says 10, 30, 37, it does not move. Why is one of my questions are, because that kind of leads me to believe that this is a little suspicious. Why does that not move? A shadow figure is seen moving from the center of the living room towards the doorway and disappears seemingly behind the wall. We can see that the camera's motion detection feature even picks up on the movement of the shadow. But see, I, what Could I don't be get... causing the strange noises in the house. What is... do you guys make of this possible I entity know. sighting? Is it a ghost? I think or this is one's there another fake. explanation for it? Just because the thing at the bottom, the timestamp does not move. You guys be the judge and comment down below as well. I don't know. Just didn't. I don't know. Next up, we are going to be looking into the haunting of Ola Peter. Peter and his brother had been spending some time at their great grandparents' house when suddenly the power went out for no logical reasoning. Their mother and grandmother leave briefly to go buy some candles at the gas station nearby. Leaving the boys alone, strange activity had been experienced in the house before and it was believed by the family that there was at least one spirit inhabiting the home. Potentially the spirit of the great grandfather that sadly had passed away. Oh, Peter boy. decides to start filming around the dark house while his parents are away. The boys head to the terrace in the back of the house to use the washroom. And this is when they first encounter something possibly paranormal. First of all, you should have candles with you at all times because you never know if this is going to happen. But let's continue. Oh, the ashes are right there. Okay. Okay. Did he not see that? There's a cat right there too. I don't know. It looks weird. A dark shadow is seen moving quickly out of sight. But what I, I, I know I keep stopping, but I'm trying to make it so, so you guys can hear me and not them as well but seeing this figure right here but then you see at the bottom right you can see an animal with eyes and it's not being it's it's not moving it's not seeing it it's not doing anything so that kind of leaves me to believe this is weird i don't know though it is hiding from the two boys see the cat doesn't even see it it's like what but it moves weird it like moves down and then oof. Goes suck back in. 
The next video was also filmed at Peter's great-grandparents' house. This time, the boys noticed some loud banging and strange noises coming from the roof of the house. Is that a cat? And so or what they is went that? Inside to try and capture whatever was responsible for all the noise. Let's take look a down, look please. What I want to see captured. Hi. Not Loud banging and strange scratching noises can be heard from above Peter. And when he aims the camera to the right, a dark shadow can be seen moving Ugh. across the roof. Could no this thanks. be the same shadow figure seen in the first video? Could it be a squirrel? Uh, I have no idea. Yes. No, tengan miedo. Is that a cat? No pasa nada. That's not even a cat. What the hell is that? I don't even know what that is. That's not even a cat. Here I thought it was a cat the entire time and it wasn't. I'm stupid. Housekeeping. Oh. <laughs> Peter actually tries to interact with the entity, inviting it to present itself to him. But he may actually get more than he bargained for. No, Peter. Viewers have said that the energy in this video is very negative, oh. and many do not believe this to be the great grandfathers. They Could also be believe this entity might be taking advantage of the fact that there were no adults present, as many demons have been known to connect first with children and using that to Could get be. to the adults in the family. But what do you think? Has Peter truly captured something paranormal in these videos? I mean, that could be like somebody just swinging a coat, but I don't know entirely. So you guys be the judge and tell me down in the comments. The next clip was uploaded to Reddit by user Squish Muffins. She writes that this <laughs> was muffin. captured by a neighbor's bedroom security camera while they were out of town for the weekend. They noticed that the camera had picked up some movement one night while they were away. Although there were no people or pets in the house the entire time, Squish Muffin states that the house has had paranormal activity occur in the past, so they were quite scared when they realized that there was motion in the supposedly empty house. Okay, but the, the fan is moving. <laughs> oh, hello. Hello there. Where'd you go? Uh oh. You playing peekaboo? The owners of the house believe what was captured here was actually the spirit of a woman who is headless. And they point out that if you look closely, oh. you can actually see what appears to be a collar of a dress or shirt oh. of the figure. They also state that they believe the spirit here is sitting up in the bed and then laying back down, as it matches perfectly with the positioning of the bed in the it room. Does. It is possible that this is the spirit of someone who either lived in the house in the past or on the land itself. What do you guys think? Is this a paranormal capture? Or is there perhaps another That's logical creepy. explanation? Well, you could say that she doesn't have a good head on her shoulder. <laughs> oh, not very funny. Okay. This clip comes to us from the Dark Dimension and was filmed in Japan. In the oh video, gosh, Japan. A group of friends are on their way to a public bathhouse. When Japanese ghosts are one of the highest, scariest videos that I've seen on this channel. And I don't want to see this, but we're going to see it anyways. And they discover it is unexpectedly closed. The group of friends are hanging out and joking around outside the closed bathhouse when they capture something on camera. Stop zooming in! <laughs> oh, what was that? Please tell me you have a, a fourth friend. Okay, one, two, three. Four! What is that? Please tell me it's what gotta be a friend. to be a person is standing next to the cameraman and then disappearing towards the ground. I got chills. It is not seen ever again. How strange. What do you think happened here? Oh. I'm sure this group will think twice in the future if they decide to ever visit the bathhouse again. <laughs> if you can see my arm right now, I look like a basketball, okay? When it comes to like those little bumps that are on basketballs, that's what it looks like on my arm right now.
Can't see it. Oh, I got a hole here. Oh, crap. <laughs> Let's continue. It looks like another friend, though. That's the thing. You guys be the judge. Comment down below. Creepy Lurker. The next creepy capture was uploaded to Reddit by user Photograph Firm. Photograph wrote this. I was running late for work one night and I was backing out of the driveway. I noticed an odd shape in my window. I snapped a quick picture, but I didn't take the time to really look at it, since as I said, I was running late. Oh. I finally got to work and took a good look at the photo. I was shocked but shocked it up to paranoia and tried not to worry, especially since I knew I would be home soon. Is he After got a my kid? shift, I did a sweep of the house and I confirmed that there was no way anyone was able to come into the house and there was no one inside the house either. Every window was locked and I never used the front door as I always enter through the garage. There was also nothing between the curtains to cause anything that could have created this shape. I don't own any cardboard cutouts and I live completely alone in a very rural area. As for the history of the house, it is around 200 years old and I know people have passed away in the house, but I have no information on them. I've experienced other paranormal instances in the house, such as hearing footsteps on the stairs and knocking on doors. This is the first paranormal photo I've ever captured. The way the face is so clear, but also so blank and emotionless. It is. It's like Truly distorted chilling. too. Could this be the spirit that is causing the strange noises around the house? What do you guys think of this photo? I don't know. Is this a true paranormal capture? Or is there perhaps something else that could explain it away? <laughs> Dining room action. A lot of household. The next video comes to us from the channel Mystic Ghost. Ghost. Mystic Ghost is a team of paranormal researchers Mystic based Ghost. in Texas. They write that their mission is to seek out allegedly haunted locations, authenticate evidence of the paranormal, research all paranormal stories, and conduct scientific methods plus metaphysical approaches during investigations. But actually, what makes this sighting so different is that it was captured in one of the investigators' own homes. When the resident received a motion alert from their dining room security camera, they were truly shocked at the capture. That's a big home. Uh... What's that in the left corner? The, the window? Oh, it's gone. Where's it going? Oh, it's back. Top left corner of the window. And then the chair moved. The only thing that bugs me is that it looks like it's replaying the same the thing chair over. Is seen sliding from the dining Hold on, you're telling me about the chair, but you're not telling me what's going on in the top left corner of that window? What? Dining table pulled by an unseen force. To make things even more unsettling. Look okay. out the window on the left. I was gonna Something say. can be seen moving rapidly outside the window. It's hard to make out the shape of the figure. It is all black and moving sporadically before disappearing again once the chair is pushed back into its original position. It looks like it's got wheels on it too. That's creepy right there. Do you believe the shadow in the window and the chair moving are connected? Or just a strange coincidence? Is it possible that the entity was trying to get the attention of someone inside the house? Let me know your thoughts on this one. Coincidence? I think not! Face in the glass! The following was sent by Ben, the a member of the Seven Souls Paranormal Team. The team is based in Florida, and Bambi kindly wanted to share the following incident with me. It was captured by their home security camera one night. They noticed that there appeared something strange unfolding right at the sliding oh, glass window. Paranormal events are nothing new for them, and the house is said to be haunted ever since they can remember. Things are being moved around, and doors are opening and closing on their own. But even shadow figures can be seen ever so often. Tonight's capture, however, was even more mysterious. Is that a puppy? Say what? Came through the glass, found on our security. make out an apparition that is looking into the sliding glass window. It appears that it is coming inside, and then it disappears towards the outside again. Could be a bug. How strange. 
Bambi also states that they can clearly see a face on that apparition. Can you too? Kind of. Looks like a mist kind of looking thing. Whatever was captured that night seemed not to be from this realm. Oh, it's from something, but it's not here. <clears throat> Yeah, it looks like it's moving towards the camera kind of thing. Make sure to check the footage out yourself. I'll this definitely have haunting. to. Shadow in my home. The following clips were shared by user BV1150, <coughs> who states that he as well is experiencing some really terrifying events unfolding in his own four walls. Ever since moving into his it's new place, he was visited <laughs> by strange shadow sightings and was woken up in the midst of night by loud banging noises and furniture that was being pushed around. His friends never believed him, however and they were certain that he was just joking around. In the following video, he had a friend over, and indeed, there seemed to be some unusual loud noises that were stemming from his closet, or from right above his closet, which was weird because nobody else should have been there. My man just took a plastic bottle of BBs and chucked it at his friend while sleeping. Oh, that pissed me off. Get up. Get up. Get up. You here? Listen. Sounds like it's pounding. Get the friend on the bed. Don't you know there's monsters underneath the bed? Who wears socks to bed? That Ouija board. They touched the Ouija board? Nothing at first glance, but after BV decides to take a look around and opens the door to one of the rooms, there seemed to be something else with them. What? Oh, it starts walking towards him. A really odd looking shadow can be seen standing at the end of the room, and then it charges at them as if it wanted to hurt them. BB states that they could not sleep at his place that night, and that he has nightmares ever since. <sighs> I can't do it. Right in the if it footage. wasn't just a kid by the young man, has maybe something demonic entered? Something that is now playing tricks on him? Oh, it's creepy looking. I can't do things that crawl or lunge at the camera. Who can say? I don't know. You guys be the judge. Tell me down below. I can't do it. Haunted pub. I could go for a nice brewski. The next video was uploaded by the user It's Raining Babies, who posts vlogs of his life and experiences. In this video, Raining is going over some haunted events that had been happening in his workplace, Wolfden Brewing. This restaurant is located within an older building, and apparently there have been quite a few paranormal experiences That's cool that looking. have occurred here. Raining even says that there is a resident ghost named Jack that is said to haunt the restaurant. The haunting of the Wolfden Brewing Pub is so well known that it is also common for restaurant guests to ask about Jack and the other ghosts. Raining says that he doesn't really believe in the paranormal, however, some of these recent events has made him to start think twice. Oh, he gonna learn today! What? Why is there a hand underneath that door? Now, you can see to the right of the door. Look at that! I don't mean to keep pausing, but there is a hand underneath that door underneath the, the stairs is that a gimmick or is it supposed to be like that or there's kind of like a, a movement right there and then it proceeds to go like up the stairs but it could be someone you know just walking on the outside on our front porch right there which is logically what it is but it almost seems that the camera's kind of bending 
and it bends the staircase a little bit. And then right after it goes to the top of the stairs, the hat seems to jump up before it falls off onto the ground and kind of rolls around. It's very weird. It's something I can't explain. It's very odd, given the design of the rack. He says it looks as though the hat was raised slightly off the hangar before falling, not something that would normally be caused by the wind. But see, like he said... Next there's... clip is also taken at the restaurant. This one was taken at Halloween, so we'll notice the decorations. Of course, the restaurant it's a clown. puts out an exhibit about the notorious John Wayne Gacy, and the security footage was captured there. The clip shows a painting of Gacy. What? Uh, what that? actually remained in the wall. Notice the way the painting seems to rotate as it falls. There's something very strange about this capture mm. for sure. What do you think? Do you believe that Wolfden Brewing is truly haunted? I, don't know. I certainly do. <clears throat> Who knows? Photobomber. The following was uploaded uh, to Reddit. Be. The mother in the photo had noticed some strange things happening around her home, such as whispers from other rooms lights turning on and off on their own, and creaking around the house when no one was walking around. The family had suspected perhaps paranormal activity had been the cause. However, they tried to ignore all these strange occurrences since there was no physical evidence of anyone being inside their home. This all changed one afternoon. The mother was home alone with their small daughter, playing with some puzzle toys and taking photos to show their family members. Uh, what she captured oh. was absolutely not what she was expecting. What the f is that? A head is seen peeking out from the cabinets behind the mother and the baby. The figure is absolutely haunting. The red eyes staring directly at the camera and the mouth twisted into a very sinister smile. The family didn't actually notice the entity until after they were done taking photos. What would were looking you do? At them later that evening. Is this the creature responsible for the strange occurrences in the house? What would you do if you would capture a sighting like this? Absolutely terrifying. Crap my pants. What the hell was that? Oh. This video was uploaded by Diego Spikers. Diego has long suspected that his apartment was haunted and actually had caught a few paranormal sightings in the past. You might remember the haunted children's tent. It was not odd for things to move on their own in his home and for strange sounds to be heard when nobody else was supposed to be home. In particular, it seemed whatever spirit was living in Diego's home had a great interest in children's toys, leading him to believe the spirits of you know what's funny and crazy is my my daughters used to have a tent like this. Thank God it's not here anymore, but it's still kind of creepy. A young kid might be haunting the apartment. One afternoon, Diego had a friend over, and they were just hanging out in the living room when they captured the following. Oh, please tell me there's somebody underneath that that is alive. Oh, I saw that one. Oh. Saw once before, still creepy. Looks like a grudge hand. And it's gone. The hand of a young child can be seen, reaching out from the TV stand and starts slowly opening the cabinet. But the hand is quickly retracted when nope. Diego starts running towards it. He opens the cabinet, but the entity is nowhere to be seen and the decorations of the shelves of the TV stands are seen undisturbed. Nope, thank you. I want to see that one with the blanket over that entity or wherever Some it was. Some viewers have wondered if this could possibly be a child who's traveling between multiple dimensions. And others have wondered if this might not be a child, but rather a darker spirit attempting to seem friendly. What do you make of this capture? A so child creepy. or something much more dangerous? Uh, I've watched the one on the top left, the scariest videos Thank on the internet. Thank you so much for watching. Oh, great, another one. <clears throat> another video that has been beautifully done by King Frostmare. I want you guys to comment down below if you guys think these are real, fake, fact fiction, whatever have you. I surely read all you guys' comments. Love the video that we guys...
we just watched. Hopefully you guys did too. Make sure you guys like the video. And again, thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you guys in the next video. So keep it real, keep it safe. And as always, keep nerding on. We'll see you guys next time. Peace.